I started thinking initially that it would be quite powerful if you could have the biggest network, like the biggest financial and identity network imaginable. You could have something truly global. Today, we're diving into something quite intriguing that's been making waves online, WorldCoin. Now, we've been noticing a lot of chatter about this new cryptocurrency recently, and we thought it's high time we take a closer look. So buckle up and let's explore what's going on with WorldCoin. So imagine there's a new kind of digital money called WorldCoin. Here's something really interesting. The person who came up with the idea of the new world coin is someone super smart. His name is Sam Altman, and he's also the one who started a big group called OpenAI. Now, what's OpenAI? It's like a team of really smart people who work on something called artificial intelligence or AI. Think of AI as the brain of computers that helps them do clever things. Now. Imagine you're hearing about this new digital money called WorldCoin. It's like a puzzle, right? Well, the person who thought of this puzzle is Sam Altman, the same person who's super good with AI stuff. And you know what? This is making people curious because OpenAI is like a star in the world of AI. So when people found out that the person who started OpenAI is also behind WorldCoin, it made them raise their eyebrows. Imagine being surprised and curious at the same time. That's what happened. This world coin has become quite important in Europe, especially in Spain. Think of Spain as a big stage where world coin is making its debut in the world of digital money. Now, they've come up with something really interesting called World ID. This is like a special way to prove who you are when you're using world coin. Instead of the usual ways that digital money works, like solving puzzles or showing how much you own, world coin wants to make sure you're a real person. They're doing this by checking things like your face, your fingerprints, and even your eye pattern. This way, they want to keep your personal information safe and secret. Think about it like showing your ID card when you want to enter a special place. WorldCoin is like the ID card for their digital money, and they're using a brand new idea that no one else has tried before. This idea is all about making sure you're a real person and protecting your privacy. It's like a secret code just for you. And it's not like the old ways of doing things with digital money where you have to do lots of computer work. This new way is all about keeping you safe and making sure you're the one using your digital money. So to sum it up, WorldCoin led by Sam Altman is making a big impact in Spain and Europe with their special digital money. They're using a cool new idea called World ID to make sure you're a real person when you use their money. And this helps keep your personal info safe. It's a bit like having a secret code that only you have, and it's different from the old ways of using digital money. What's really cool is that WorldCoin has teamed up with important groups like IT Barcelona and Digital Tools for Humanity. Imagine these groups as smart friends who are good at important things. This teamwork has made WorldCoin even stronger in Spain. In the same way, WorldCoin is working with these groups to become better and more important in Spain. This teamwork has also made Spain more interested in something called artificial intelligence or AI. AI is like the brain of computers, helping them think and do smart things. Spain wants to be really good at AI, and because of this teamwork, they're getting closer to being the best at AI in all of Europe. Okay, let's take a closer look at the important details. WorldCoin is doing something quite different from other digital money. It's not just another type of digital money like Bitcoin or others you might have heard of. It's actually aiming for something really big. Think about it like this. You know how sometimes people get money from their jobs, right? Well, WorldCoin is trying to do something special. They want to give money to people without them having to work for it. Imagine getting money just because you exist and not because you have a job. This is called universal basic income. It's like a gift of money that everyone gets no matter what. And this idea is what WorldCoin is trying to bring to life. So when you hear about WorldCoin, remember that it's not just about regular digital money. It's about this big idea of giving money to people without them needing to have a job. It's like a special kind of gift for everyone. And that's why it's catching people's attention, because it's something different and appealing. But to ensure that WorldCoin stays secure and free from fraudulent activities, the authentication process involves a unique iris scan. The scanners used for this purpose might remind you of something from a sci-fi movie. But in a world where artificial intelligence is blurring the lines between humans and robots, 
these scanners have become necessary to maintain the integrity of the system. Now, you might be wondering why such a stringent authentication process is being implemented. Well, as AI continues to advance, it's becoming increasingly challenging to differentiate between humans and robots. This has prompted WorldCoin's innovative approach to make sure that every transaction is carried out by a genuine individual. But hold on, there's more to this story. With the rise in concerns about the legitimacy of cryptocurrencies and their potential for unhealthy speculation, regulatory bodies have been stepping up their efforts to monitor the crypto space. As a result, despite its name, WorldCoin won't be available for use in the United States. Here's something really interesting to think about. Doesn't this strict way of confirming who you are go against the idea of staying anonymous, which many people who like cryptocurrencies care about? Let us explain. Imagine you're playing a secret game where you can do things without anyone knowing it's you. That's a bit like how cryptocurrencies work. You can use them without everyone knowing your real identity. But now with WorldCoin, it's like they're doing something different. They want to make sure you're truly you by checking your special details like fingerprints and eye scans. Now let's hear from someone named Elisa, a senior reporter and AI specialist at Coindesk. She's sharing her thoughts on this. She says, this is an interesting thing to think about. In the world of cryptocurrencies, we like that our actions are recorded on the digital system, but people don't directly know who we are. It's a bit like being a secret agent. With WorldCoin, they want to make a special digital version of your eye pattern, kind of like a secret code. This is like having a special address for your digital money. This way, we can still keep some anonymity, like using a nickname, while also making sure everything is safe. So, to sum up, this whole thing about proving who you are might seem different from how cryptocurrencies usually work, where you can stay kinda hidden. But some experts think that WorldCoin is trying to find a balance. They want to make sure things are safe and private, like using a secret code while still letting you keep some of that hidden feeling. It's like finding a way to have the best of both worlds. This idea has sparked both interest and concern. Some argue that this could potentially pave the way for a future where jobs are scarce and access to money hinges on sharing your biometric data. It's a concept that raises questions about privacy, control, and the balance between technology and personal freedom. WorldCoin's expansion into other countries like Germany has further fueled discussions. Some reports suggest that WorldCoin's integration with identity management software is raising concerns about data privacy and how information is collected for the project's database. The million dollar question is, is this the path we want to take? Are we comfortable with the trade-off between financial benefits and our personal data? It's a complex issue that's emblematic of our evolving digital landscape. This isn't about a new cryptocurrency. It's about the broader implications of technology and its impact on our lives. It's about understanding the potential risks and rewards and making informed decisions. After all, in a world where information is power, we need to be mindful of the choices we make and the data we share. Stay tuned, we'll continue to explore the world of WorldCoin, the promises, the concerns, and what it all means for our digital future. So until then, take care, and remember, your data is valuable. Think before you share.